Here with Chuckers first year manager Troy Percival. Skip, uh, how have you found the Pioneer League so far in your first season in it? Surprisingly more competitive, more talented uh, than what I anticipated. A lot of fun. Um, you played in Boise during your minor league time. To clinch their first Northwest League championship last night in front of a near capacity crowd at Memorial Stadium. Heroes galore in the 7-3 victory. Brandon Markowitz knocked home two runs, putting his club in front to stay there in the fourth inning. Elgin Bobo, five for five, driving in two and scoring a pair. Sean Purdy worked six innings of four-hit ball, leaving with a 7-3 lead. Julian Herrera with a strong relief effort, and closer Troy Percival did his job superbly, setting off a wild celebration in the middle of the diamond. Now, coming back to places like that as a manager, did you get that kind of excitement that you had again as a younger player? Well, you never get the same excitement as a player, but um, the excitement of coaching professionally with so many talented guys and getting to experience what a front office guy has to uh, experience as far as releasing players, finding new players, getting them signed. Um, so there's a lot that goes into it. Um, what, what was the biggest difference for you switching from the college game at UCR to here? Would it be that signing guys and that yeah, aspect of it? The biggest difference is you can replace players. If guys get hurt, uh, there's other avenues other than just wait till they get healthy and come back. You know, the college routine, you have who you have, and that's, that's where you're at for the year. And now uh, you're obviously heavy pitching background. You've worked with the pitchers a little more extensively this year, but uh, has it been fun to kind of get into that hitter's mindset at times too? Yeah, especially having Bob here. You know, Bob's the accomplished pitching coach, got tons more experience even than I do uh, as far as the coaching goes. So I watch the pitching, I give my two cents to Bob, but otherwise, yeah, I pretty much focused on um, how we're going to set up the lineup, if we're going to be playing a fast game, if it's a face to face type of day. Um, and knowing what kind of pitching you're going to be facing, how many runs you're going to need if you're playing one run at a time, or you got to play for some big innings. So that, that part's been fun. Thanks, Skip. You got it.